Well, I actually long, long time ago, I started a business uh, ice cream called Eat Glue. It's an ice cream sandwich shop. And uh, not because I like to start an ice cream sandwich shop, <laughs> because uh, I, I want to rent this place from an association. Because if I don't rent it, or they don't, can rent it out, then they cannot remodel the building. And I'm part of this association. So I decided, okay, I'll help them out. I'll rent this place. And then I went home, basically talked to my family, and said, what, what should we do with it? And of course, all the kids, let's have an ice cream store. <laughs> so I did. And also, not just to, because of that, I have ice cream store, because the minister uh, of Presbyterian Church called Frank Ma, he's always very involved with the young people, Chan Tao. So he, come, he came to talk to me, said, Henry, you know, I heard that you rent this place. Why do you structure so that the young people, a place for the young people to be? So I did that. So what I did, I hired basically all the young people. And I knew, you know, in, in Chinatown Law, you know all the young kids. And you know who are the troublemakers and things like that. And so I hired them. You know, the troublemaker is the one that really hard to work because I feel that if they, you give them some responsibility, you know, something to do, they actually keep the rest of the kids out of trouble too. And so that's what happened, you know. And I see them now, made me very happy. I see them. Uh, the business is lousy, I didn't make any money, I lose money. But I'm happy because my reward is to see those kids grown up. They are insurance agents, they are, you know, they're successful. They walk the street, they see me, they're all high. Yeah, you know, they're happy, they are high, they're young. To me, that's a good satisfaction.